I probably would have been in a much better space. You know, I would have, uh, I would have done things that I, this is nothing, this is just clothing. This is a cosmetic. What is important is how do you develop the money that you make at a particular stage? And trust me, what I know now about money is just something that I will cherish for a very long time. Are you saying there was nobody leading you back then, telling you, so, see you put money aside? Thomas, uh, you know, yes, if truth be told, we also need to understand the system of education at that time. It was very complex, it was difficult for black people to be in a position where they study economics. You know, when you go to school, the only thing that you were taught was always about being uh, either a doctor or a lawyer. Even now, the doctors, lawyers, needed people who understood economics to be able to evolve and develop their money. So there was no space really where we can learn. For me, everything has always been a trial and error process where I realized, oh, okay, if I bought a car, it's different to if I had bought a flat. Because if I had bought a flat, I would have rented it out, you know, where there's income. But if I buy a car, there's insurance which I have to pay and continuously pay insurance and pay the installment and the money just runs out. What happened to the vehicle? The value goes down. What happens to the value of the flat? It increases. Today, if I had that flat, if I were to sell it, I would make even more money than the car that's somewhere in the script. Mm. Could you, would you not say that's an image thing as well, depending on the type of music that you create? Oh yeah, and you know, knowing hip-hop, hip-hop celebrates the moolah, yeah. spending, yeah. playing, you know, and that's, you know, for me for a long time, you know, I, I find myself a bit conflicted, you know, between two worlds, but I think I, I attribute my success to guys like Buga Love. So Cabello gave me a random call one time. He's like, hey, Tati, hey, Tati, hey, Tati. You don't want to make the same mistakes that I made. He used to share a lot of stories about how they squandered their cash in the TKZ days. You know, and those stories were funny. But one time he called me and he linked me with his financial advisor. That was a game changer for me, right? Got a life policy, started saving money. Literally a couple of days after I got my life policy, that's when the, the shooting incident happened. Mm. So it shows you how short life is, right? And then, you know, fast forward, you know, the drought for musicians is it's like inevitable. It's, it's going to happen. And when the drought kicked in, that's how I was, I, was, I was able to sustain all the money that I had saved up. You know what I mean? And I have to also say that surrounding myself with professionals and guys who have the expertise in, 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 in the field of finance is key. You know what I mean? Uh, not just your bra with a diploma. I'm talking about <laughs> guys who do the work, you know? And that, that has been a lifesaver for me. Yeah. yeah. And that conversation we're going to have later on as well is how both of you at one point lost everything. Oh, yeah. We had hit songs on radio, yeah. everybody was playing your music, yeah. but you had nothing. And these are really important conversations to have. Uh, but you heard it from the uh, ladies themselves. Say you. just said we both lost everything. I didn't lose much. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I just. Jeez, <laughs> that's your off. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Stream live on our Metro FM Facebook page. This is of course brought to you in partnership with All Mutual.